Let's do chassis. Oh my goodness. Welcome to my Golden Games and welcome to today's video. So for this one, we are gonna be doing a how to install add-on vehicles for GTA 5. So to begin, we're just gonna take a look at this vehicle here. It's the 2014 McLaren add-on. And basically this was just the most downloaded vehicle on GTA 5's modest website. Uh, we got the link here, which we'll go to, let me just copy that on my secondary monitor here. Uh, pull this up. All right, there we go. Let's get that pulled over here. And we're just gonna pop the link in there. Super quick and easy. You know, you just go to the download link and full screen that. And you'll just download the mod right here, which I've already done, but basically you'll click the download link and it'll download there. You want to save it somewhere on your computer where you know where it's at in case, you know, something happens to your game and you need to reinstall it. We downloaded it. We have it saved in this folder here. And basically, we're just going to open the file, which if you don't have 7-zip, just download 7-zip right now. I'm not going to show you on how to do that. If you want to know how to download 7-zip and use it and everything, let me know in the comments below and I will, you know, make another video on that. Uh, but basically, once we open the mod, let's pull it up here. You want to go, see, there's two versions, I guess. There's the replace and add-on. For this one, we are doing an add-on because I do have a, already a replacement video from a few years ago. Basically the same thing for replacement vehicles. But for add-on, we'll double-click that, double-click update, and X64, DLC packs, uh, P1. All right, so P1, we're going to take that and drag that to the desktop because that is actually the name of the mod. And it looks like we're good there. So we're gonna close that and we're gonna wanna open up Open 4, which again is on my secondary monitor. So give me a second here. All right, so once we open Open 4, we're gonna click on Windows. Again, this is only for the PC version of Grand Theft Auto, by the way. Doesn't really work on the Xbox or PlayStation version. Now that we're in Open 4, we're gonna go to our mods folder and go to update x64 dlc packs and let's go to edit mode right at the top here a yes and then let's drop the folder for the mod right there p1 and there we go looks good let's go to x64 vehicles and then let's just open this and this should be the model of the vehicle there it is looks beautiful we're going to go back to the root of the mods folder go to update update common data and then we're going to look for dlc list which is right there we're going to right click that and as you can see i got i got a lot of add-ons and everything installed but basically i'm just going to copy this paste it there and we're going to want to put inside the brackets there uh, p1 and save that and now the mod should be installed so we're going to hop inside grand theft auto and let's see what it looks like all right, boys, so we are in Grand Theft Auto 5 now, so let's get over. Uh, why is my controller not working? What? Why? That's odd. Okay, I think my USB port is getting a little uh, worn out. I've been using that USB port for quite a few years. Okay, so we're in game now, so let's go over here, and we're going to use menu. I love menu so much. Like it is, I feel the best trainer mod you can download. So just M A M E N Y O O. Just look that up on GTA 5 mods, and uh, yeah, definitely. I I might have a link to it as well. I I'll have a link to it in the video description down below. If you're enjoying the video so far, please do hit the like button. That really does help me out when you do that. And maybe consider subscribing if you haven't already, as well as hitting the little bell icon on the channel. That way you stay notified when the videos go up and when we do live streams. Anyways, let's go over here, go to vehicles and vehicle spawner. Scroll down to the bottom where it says input model. All we're gonna type in is P1, and hopefully it works. Boom, look at that, ooh, that is sexy. Let's see, how's it sound? Ooh, and it's got the automatic uh, um, wing, couldn't couldn't think there, spoiler. That is real, ooh, ooh, that is, ooh, that's sexy. Uh, so yeah, this, this vehicle model actually came out in 2015. But it's got so many mods. So if we go into menu again really quick, menu customs, let's do chassis. Oh my goodness. So that just removed the entire trunk and everything. Look at that. That is sexy. This is why people mod Grand Theft Auto. 
I mean, look how freaking beautiful that is. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed it. That's going to be it. It's a very quick stream, but to the point. So I really hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions or any other videos that you want me to do how-to on, seriously, let me know in the comments below. Come check out the Discord server. Hit me up in there, and I'll try to do my best to get that to you. I really do hope you enjoyed it. Uh, we do have a few more how-tos currently in the works right now. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please do consider subscribing if you did enjoy it. Have a great day, guys, and see you next time.